Danger and harm for chemical in our food from ultra-processed foods More than half of the calories consumed in an average household in the US or UK comes from ultra-processed foods. Consumption is already high in the developed world and rapidly increasing in developing countries. However, recent scientific studies have linked eating UPF with serious health issues like diabetes, obesity, and even cancer. Although current studies cannot prove causation, experts believe reducing UPF in a diet is essential for overall well-being. Eating this stuff regularly, every single day, every meal, accumulating all these chemicals in our body, they make us overeat by 25% said Tim Spector, a professor of epidemiology at King's College London and the co-founder of ZOE, a personalized nutrition app. Most of the ultra-processed food that you find are higher in salt, fat, and sugar. They are designed extremely tasty, they're ready to eat, and they are aggressively marketed, especially to children, comma. Dr. Kiara Chang of Imperial College London noted, I in the UK, where one in four people are obese, there are growing calls for the food industry and the government to act and offer healthier options to the population. The $128 billion British food and beverage industry is the largest manufacturing sector in the country, employing more than 400,000 people. We are calling for food sector companies to report a set of health and sustainability metrics that would be on a mandatory basis. Said Sophie Lawrence, who leads a group of investors called the Investor Coalition for Food Policy, managing assets worth $7 trillion. We need to make sure that the government and businesses are acting to actually change the food environment people are living in, said Rebecca Toby, Senior Business and Investment Manager at the Food Foundation.